All right, ladies, it is time for another new beauty test tube. Ah, I love getting these things. First started off with new beauty test tube, absolutely hating it. It is a very expensive subscription. It is $40 a month, and my first tube was atrocious. It was awful. It was like I was crying almost in the video. But each time I've gotten it since then, I have liked it even more each time. I do want to let you know that I um, have an opportunity for a $5 off code. Anyone who subscribed to New Beauty Test Tube can give $5 off to anyone who um, you give a referral to and then I get a free tube. So I want to thank this person here. I've lost track of who I'm on. I know all the people's names that have gotten me free tubes, but I, I don't know which one I'm on right now. So I thank you to this person for getting me this free tube. I do have to pay for the shipping, which I think is like nine bucks. So if you are interested in getting the $5 off of New Beauty Test Tube, um, you're just gonna send me an email uh, with your email address, and then I send your email address to New Beauty Test Tube, and they send you an email that says, you know, how to get your $5 off. So if you're interested in that, just shoot me an email at jenlovesreviews at gmail.com. All right, let's go ahead and without further ado, let's open this thing up because I am too excited. All right, let's see. That's the way it comes packaged. Just beautiful. Thank you for being part of the test tube community. You know, I don't feel like there is a test tube community, at least not that I've found, but I appreciate that they thank me for being a part of something that I didn't know actually existed. Uh, okay, so here we go. So we're going to open up this tissue paper, and the first thing I see is that we got some bonus items. I'm going to save those for last and I'm going to show you. We got, ooh, we got a candle. It's by Votivo Icy Blue Pine. I'm not a big pine tree scent fan, but my husband is, so I bet he will like this. Oh yeah, he's going to love this. He loves any um, clean, crisp smells and this definitely smells clean and crisp. Cool. I'm very happy to have it. All right, let's get into the tube. This is the way the tube looks. It also comes with this. This has all of the products in it. I'm not going to look at that yet unless I need to. And this says, as a test tube member, you still get a subscription to New Beauty Magazine. They will send this separately. So that's cool. That works. It says you get it four times a year. So I guess this is my off month because I think we got it last time. So I will be getting this probably next month. Oh, I forgot to tell you, New Beauty Test Tube comes every other month, not every month. So that kind of makes the $40 price tag more like a $20 a month. And you do get considerably more products in New Beauty Test Tube than you do in the $10 or $20 a month um, subscription. Please don't spill on me. Beautiful. And it is packed to the top. All right, so what did we get? First thing we got was an exfoliant by Go Therapeutics Refresh Facial Polish. Turn box for a special gift. To reveal, visit their website. It's probably a discount, I am assuming. And it is a 2B2B two -two and you get exactly one ounce, which is, I think, whenever I get one ounce, I'm always happy, especially for um, any kind of sample products. I feel like one ounce is a significant amount of product to be able to try something, so I'm really happy about that. It has jojoba beads, barrage oil, and acai, acai, I never know how to say that, oil, and it's a facial scrub. I am looking forward to trying that. But I will let you know in my monthly favorites video if any of these things are amazing or horrible. If they're just mediocre, you'll never see them again. Next up, oh, we got a little tiny Vaseline Lip Therapy. Cute, and it's called Rosy Lips. And it is already open a little. Oops. Oh, it's already open pretty much all the way. I have a feeling that was just in packaging or something. It just got jab jabbed somewhere. I'm not stressed out about that. Doesn't smell too much. I think they're trying to jump on that that rose balm kind of feeling. I'm gonna put it on because I have a matte, the matte uh, new, I have on this new Revlon Color Burst Matte Balm in sultry on my lips right now, so it's very matte. So I'm just gonna go ahead and put this on. That's actually quite nice. It's not um, oily, like Vaseline products typically are. Um, if you saw my Vaseline Kool-Aid Experimento uh, Pinterest Busters thing, you'll know how much I hated the feel of Vaseline on my lips, but this doesn't feel like that. It's just very smooth, very nice. Yeah, it's got, still has the petrolatum as the number one ingredient, but it doesn't feel slimy like Vaseline typically does. That's kind of cool, and it's really cute to put in your purse or your jacket pocket or whatever. All right, next up we got a stri Strivectin. Holy gajoli, they just went all out this, this month. Um, get Even Brightening Serum. 
Exfoliation accelerates. Skin tone appears brighter. Pigmentation normalizes. Dark spots visibly fade. Now, I don't really have these problems with my skin, so I may either put this in my giveaway box or give this to a friend because I don't want to waste this on my skin that doesn't really need this, even though this looks like an absolutely amazing product. Next, we got a Glycerin Hand Therapy French Vanilla Hand Lotion. And I am actually just starting to run out of one of my hand lotions, so I'm definitely going to open this and keep this. Oh, that smells amazing. It smells like a cupcake to me. Vanilla cupcake. Comes out very thick. Ooh, that feels nice. I like that stuff. Ooh, this is by Camille Beckman. Cool, I like this stuff. I've never heard of this and I really like it. Lumine, I do like Lumine. Lumine is a drugstore brand, but I've loved everything that I've gotten from Lumine. Time Freeze Anti-Aging CC Cream. Yeah, I love me some CC Cream. Ha. So excited! And it's in medium, so what I'll probably have to do with this is mix it with something that's a little bit too light, which is fine with me. Yeah. Oh no! It actually looks good with my skin tone. Look at that. Sweet! Love that so far. Matches my skin tone nicely. Looking forward to this. Wow. And it's on um, sunscreen SPF 20. It says for all skin types. Very, very, very cool. Okay, we got a little package from Dove, and this is something I don't really like to see in new beauty test tubes. Um, I would not have picked these up, but last time I said that, it was John Frieda hair shampoo and conditioner stuff, and I loved it, so maybe I might be wrong on this. Nutri Nutritive Solutions Daily Moisture Conditioner and Shampoo, and that's what that looks like, and it looks like it does have sodium laureth sulfate. And I have color treated hair, so I'll have to make sure that I am not supposed to use this. I'm sure these will go to a good home to somebody that I know. I'm give it to my mom. I'm going to go see my mom today, so I'll bring these to my mom. Molten Brown London Pink Peppered Nourishing Body Lotion. See, I don't mind getting one lotion, but getting two lotions, I think that's a little much. Smells good. Smells a little, I don't know, a little fruity. Let me see. It's hard to smell because I have the other lotion on me. Oh, pink pepper pod. I said peppering. I was waiting for the peppermint, but it's not. It's pink pepper pod, whatever in the world pepper pod is. I don't know. It smells pretty good. kind of smells a little grandma-y. little grandma-y, but that's okay. Maybe I'll give it to my grandma. I bet you she would really like this. Her name is June. And then this is the last thing, and this is John Frieda Frizz Ease Straight Fixation Smoothing Cream. I loved the John Frieda products that I got last time. I think I got those actually in my Ipsy bag. But I'm looking forward to trying this because now John Frieda is in the category of good brand names. So I am looking forward to trying this. My hair always needs anti-frizz. Make sure it, there's nothing crazy happening. Do I have anything crazy happening right now? A little bit. Always. Always. Oh wait, I still have my um, my bonus products. And usually this is packed full of stuff. It doesn't look like it is this time. I've got a... Um, Smooshed John Frieda three days straight for curly. Three days straight for curly hair. I don't have curly hair, I have wavy hair, but I'm sure I could try it and see. Oh, okay, so it's kind of like my It's a 10, Miracle Leave-In Light. I have a ton of different ones of these. Um, so I will definitely try this, the John Frieda version of it and see what I think about that. One other thing, a little foil packet of stem cell superfood facial oil. Targets dehydration and fine lines for an instant glow. Sure, we'll try it, little foil pack. That's okay, this is the bonus item, so it's all good. But overall, um, for $40, I don't know. As far as, the way I like to grade a subscription service is whether I would have personally gone out and purchased the items. So overall, would I have purchased $40 worth of stuff out of here? Probably not. I probably would not have purchased this because I have lots of these things. Definitely would not have purchased these shampoos. Would not have purchased the Strivectin, even though I know a lot of people, probably this would work better for them, but personally, I would not have purchased that. The Vaseline, I would never have purchased, but I'm very thankful to have, so we'll put this in the keep category. John Frieda Frizzies, I probably never would have tried this um, if I didn't get it just now, but I'm looking forward to trying it, so we'll save, save that one. Really, really like this lotion, so we'll save that one. CC cream, definitely, this was actually my favorite thing in the box, and it's a drugstore product, but I'm excited about it. The exfoliant, I probably wouldn't have purchased, but I'm happy to have it. This lotion, I probably never would have bought, so this one will go in here. And the candle, my husband and I, you know, we, we have the same bank account, and he probably would have bought this, so we'll keep this out as far as something that probably would have been purchased. So overall, for $40, this is probably what I would have 
but I don't think that this month was worth the $40. Usually they include more makeup products. Uh, this time they only included one, which bums me out. But I think that this tube would have been amazing for some people. It wasn't amazing for me just because of my personal preferences. But overall, I'm very thankful to have it. I'm thankful to have these products here. And, you know, it's an okay tube. It's all right. All right, thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, make sure you hit the thumbs up button down below. It gets this video more exposure, moves me up in ranking on YouTube as being generally more awesome. I appreciate that. And also make sure you hit the subscribe button if you enjoyed this video and would like to see more videos by moi. Your question for this week is, would you have enjoyed getting this tube? Are these products that you feel like you would have used? Do you feel like it was worth $40? for you. Mad love to you, my friends, and I will see you in a video very, very, very soon. Bye!